I'm gonna show you guys how to make an improvised junctional tourniquet using a rigid water bottle and a soft tea tourniquet. So you might run into a case to where you might have a wound that's so high up into the pelvis that you can't get a tourniquet on it. Here's an improvised way you can stop that arterial bleed. Go ahead and unbuckle your tourniquet. Run that buckle all the way out. Take the tail, run underneath your patient. In a seesaw motion, get the tail of that tourniquet situated just at the top of your patient's hip bones there. Grab your rigid water bottle and lay it at about a 45 degree angle where the leg connects to the torso. Buckle your tourniquet and pull the slack out. Tighten down the windlass as you normally would until the bleeding stops. Make sure to secure it. And now you've effectively stopped that life-threatening bleed that you couldn't get to with a tourniquet on the limb. So there you have it. Improvised junctional tourniquet using a, a rigid water bottle and a softy tourniquet. Stay safe, stay alive.